Hmm. I'm gonna take the sniper so straight up. Straight up. Yeah, I'll do the broom. If you look to you, it's like, ooh. So. Ooh, less track. Can they draft to answer? Could they not just do an anti base game? No. Oh, they want to keep the pace high themselves. They draft the vengeful spirit. They only throw As you him. said, it's. Ladies and gentlemen, it's quite a bit of an interesting one. There is sort of a game or two off the court. They really wanted to push him off of this wave when you have a double or triple range creep. They w he won't be able to farming it, farm it, but he will get the experience. So, Brewmaster getting close to level 5 while Universe only level 3. The stun does come out and we connect. Oh, yeah, well, they got the follow up damage. He's going to have his back up in a second. Yaj turning with the clap, trying to retreat. Yaj will go down. So, Fnatic get first blood. They're very deep though behind this tower. They have a second stun. Envy again. They may get a couple out of this as Nando is falling low. Get the magic missile off. Can Nando survive? He can with the stick charges. He'll turn. They'll punish both of them. The one keeping Nando alive. As a two for one goes the way of execration. Fnatic did get that first blood, but the dive does cost them. That is a core rotation though. This is going to give space to Universe down bottom. They will be able to shrine though. For a burrow strike. Grims will be able to create the distance. Carl underneath the tower. Pi is still hunting for him. Pi actually no, turns for the disruptor instead. Goes in with the burrow strike. Will take the life of Grims. Now Carl going back towards Pi with Lumic, but they don't have detection. He just hit level four from that kill. Pi. They're not done. He's not indeed. They've got one stun. Into another, there'll be a sort of defensive attack, but it's not really going to save this man as Envy has the follow up stun. Double kill for Pi, they're very long Fnatic. And you can see Carl, he really wants to get these kills. He will find Pi. On, Envy. Envy's going for the TP out, but he's not going to make it. Magic Missile's there, so Carl has the vision and control to set up for his double kill. So again, I mean, Fnatic, they're getting these kills, but they're diving behind the twos. And uh, each time, actually, they've been giving a double kill to the core of X. They've got a lot of chain stun here. And a hell of a lot of burst. Carl's ready to use the Astral. Oh, he's in serious trouble. He is. The Burrow Strike into MV stun. More than enough control to take down that OD. The Assassinate not even it, it from our bed. Indeed, every time he uses that Astral aggressively, he's in trouble. He's juking out the net. He is looking for the net. Oh, he's, but using, he's using the tree line. In some trouble now. I've still got him. Net into the Magic Missile. Spent his gold. He bought an urn. So they think they're they're trying to figure out where the ward actually is. Look, they're pinging all these different locations, and they actually are spotted in their smoke anyway from that high ground ward. So they have Bruce Blade available. They want to try to quickly. The Brew is there. Steal some experience. And he finishes it up. Stun. Pia uh, under high ground. Comes him back down into the kinetic field. They'll pop the stampede. They have got backup coming in in the form of Arbet. Pia like die will survive for now. They look towards Lumic, have the chase down with the Burrow Strike, they'll get the kill. They forced Bruce Split top. Actually, I think he was trying to go for Envy or something there, but that's a Brew. Brew ulti down now, which is one of their big team fight ultis right now, until they have the Naga sleep with the Static Storm set up. And Universe, during all of this happening, all this pressure, 700 away from the blink. He's going to be the big one to look at for him to get the catch on Execration. Look at this with his haste from Pi. Trying to chase down Carl. Won't quite get universal range for this next stop unless he gets some really good body blocks off. Lumen's gonna be there though with the detection. The Astral holding the Sand King in place. Pilot dies still some time left on the haste run, and that will get him out of there. Carl turns towards Universe. The roots back up. He's racking up the imp but the three-man burrow strike. Holds back that of execration. Grimms still looking to try and help chase if they can get the vision for the glimpse and such, and they will. Glimpses back universe into the kinetic field. Universe will die. Pi still running around trying to make space. Nando gets the stun. Connects. Pi's dead. Bit of a, a messy play there in terms of positioning from Pi and yeah. Universes. That you can see they were tempted into try and make some that happen with the, the haste rune of Pi Lodi, but Under it's the costing their lives. Under the shrine, it's always going to be. You're going to have to expect some kind of rotations to come out. So Naga, closer and closer to six. They do have Disruptor ulti at the ready to try to go for something here. Top, Yaj. DJ forces Envy forward. Oh. And yeah. Yash is very dead. Yeah, no promise split, no escape. Ah, oh, but now on a killing spree, picking up these kills as he goes lane to lane. Top net worth, though, as we can see, and very close between the Venge, the OD, and the Sniper. As this game again, much closer than what we saw in game one this time around. He's, I think Envy's tongue him to bait. And the bait. Here it is. Envy there, Envy. 
Now trying to fight back. Has that damage from this Edict just ripping Nando to pieces. Nando, he needs help, but he needs it now. Carl's coming in. There'll be the swap. Oh, it's a swap into an Assassinator. And now, and now Carl, Carl is in trouble as well. They got both of them killed. That was that was a nice play there though by Envy. Him and DJ definitely just being like, oh, go, come on, bait, bait him. He's gonna go. So perfect read of the play there. And Universe blinked out. Let's see. Smoke to spell, but man, DJ a little too speedy. Gets close. Oh, maybe not. And you have the vision. Lining DJ light. knocks them back. He's got his four staff as well, but they should be able to catch this. Yeah, the four heroes surrounding the call. In fact, full, the full five man of execration. Do you manage to claim DJ's life? Instantly, Fnatic goes and pushes the side lanes. Yash shows himself in the mid lane. Now they're going to jump in. They are going to look to play around with this brew, but Yash does. It's, as we can see, pretty tanky on the Brewmaster, so they'll have to leave. The, they did pop the song there, maybe trying to see if they could catch someone, but with the stamp Level 12, so it's still level 1. Radiance middle tower is under attack. Not bad. Pop. He's got the catch. Onto the OD, follow up with the Burrow Strike. The perfect stun control, but no, the full stuff. By a little time for Khan with the Static Storm. The play in turn from Execration coming and back. Abed. They jump forward. They've caught out Yax. That's going to be one down. Arbet's going to get blown up as the Sound of Eclipse gets dropped by Carl. Execration. They found two out of this. Maybe even more as they look towards Pi Pi. Jigs it off with the Sandstorm. Goes over to the OD. But the control there with the net. With the magic missile. Execration. Saving the OD there. As it really looked like he was going to get changed up but that four star breaking up the combo, getting Carl out of it. And it was also uh, Nando, he just straight beelined to the sniper in the back, yeah. got the stun off, and Abed just got ripped to shreds by that Venge. Uh, well, oh, eh, Pi? Pi? He is dead. Yeah. I mean, he, he, got, he got a few creeps with the bar strike. Tactical feet. Tactical Double tome yeah. by Envy. Like you said, Envy. He loves the times loves for himself. The tomes. Yep. Towards that 25. The Bruce do love mid lane. Jump in. They've got the Astro. They're bringing in Grimms for that Static Storm to hold down the center. It is a center. It's pretty tanky, but Carl, of course, with the pure damage, does a lot. Sanity's Eclipse. Oh, it's not quite enough, is it? Oh, with the Glimpse, they'll have him, surely. They get the final touch for Universe. Will go down. Takes quite a bit. But it does take the Centaur out of the hands of Fnatic. Mm -hmm. And uh, the OD, Carl, he's, uh, he's doing some heavy work this game, as, uh, as needed. I mean, Carl, as we've said, for Execration, definitely being the standout player, is he's had very solid performances throughout the day. Yeah, and they're getting... They're bringing, the song. bringing the lash. There's the combo. In they go. Universe jumping in on the sidelines. Looking to disrupt that Naga. With the Naga gone, there's no song. The road trap before. Arbet denies the Aegis. He takes it away from them. And they found two. They do it here. Arbet with a double. The triple kill. Fnatic and they, ripping them apart. Lumic was showing himself outside the pit. He just gets stunned. So they have no, no sleep combo. No chance for the song. Abed reaches him from the side and he gets the deny on the Aegis. He says, if we can't have it, no one can. And they can full heal everybody. They can go for this push. There is everything pretty much available for Execration, though. They use uh, Static Storm, but all the other heroes have their ultis. Fnatic, though. This is their time to try to breach that high ground. It is, and they've got that push with the Diabolic Edict. Melting on your doorstep. And they're just going to keep getting full healed. Illuminate. Mm. And with the three cores dead, Execration, nothing to do. And as you say, they already have BKB. They got to try. Lumic. The thing is that, yeah, the, the, it's, it's, just a, it's just a halt. I mean, they're trying with this primal split, and it will keep Fnatic off the racks for now at least, but they've got to be careful with the Bruling. The primal split, he's lost two of them already. Carl has to sell Vastral. Envy pops the BKB there for the MP center revving up. Carl will get swapped back. Ooh, that's what by time, but the Assassinate flies through. Arbet hits the headshot. Sniper getting the kill, and Fnatic now, they are just forcing Execration back and apart. They're just all full health. As Fnatic will claim this mid-set of racks. They're not done, it's the daytime. Arbet is just peeping people from the sidelines. Another Assassinate to finish off the brew. And they're going down to the bottom lane. Yeah, they're, it's the it's, They're going to have full healed again. They got the coddle. The mana machine, the heal machine. I mean, Fnatic so getting aggressive they're again. They're just jumping. In a they force him back, the sentries down, Will the blast back as well, putting Nando into the hands of Fnatic, as Fnatic 
taking the kills, core after core, looking for the second set of racks, they're ready to play for the brown outside of the fountain, they jump in, Static Storm is there, but Lumic gets beaten down, that's no Naga Siren. Universe has a fight too, I think this is just game over Owen. I mean it always hurts to sort of point it on one position, one player, but as you said, Lumic being same time I've seen happen a lot when Liquid plays this card. So from that 24 to 28 minute mark, the game just pretty much ends if they get that momentum. They're gonna stab me forward. They're looking to close the gap. Bottom lane, Pi, he's moved in onto Nando. Nando, he's not Two minutes gonna done. get out. The sentries are down. They've got the vision mid lane. They'll lose the Naga Siren. The BKBs have come out. Assassinate from the side will be dodged by this Astral. But Envy looking for the timing. He's going to find it. They catch out the OD. Carl down for 60 seconds. He does have buyback, but Nando, he does not. They just never have to stop, too. Universe TPs to base, gets recalled back. Envy's gonna go bottom, pick up his item, uh, his plate mail, get recalled. Oh, and Nando, he's walked out to his own death. There's no escape for this Ventral Spirit. He's outside of the base, he has gone down. No buyback on Nando. A minute without the Venge. And Fnatic know that they can get away with whatever they want now. Even picking up a shadow blade on OD, you know that they're desperate. Execration with the way that they're getting beat down at the jump four. The two man who stop comes in from Universe. The static storms down, but the BKB is already out from Envy. He's looking to chase down Lumic, who's trying to get back to base, but the AoE damage from the less tracks too much. As Fnatic are slowly beating Execration down. They'll go for the third set of Rags, Carl. Jumping in. He's got the Shadow Blade, tries to get himself out of there, but he's out of mana. Jump off from Universe, they have the control. GG well played is called. Ladies and gentlemen, your victors of the Southeast Asian qualifiers for the Corsair Dream League Lamp Finals are fanatic. With a very good showing in very the last